আসসালামু আলাইকুম আই লাইক টু থ্যাংক ইউ অল অফ থ্যাংক অল অফ ইউ ফর ইয়োর সাপোর্ট ইন দিস টিউটোরিয়াল জ্যাঙ্গো অ্যান্ড ফ্লাটার ইন দিস পার্ট আই উইল ট্রাই টু কভার ইমেল ভ্যারিফিকেশন অ্যান্ড ফরগেট পাস পাসওয়ার্ড অর রিসেট পাসওয়ার্ড বিফোর দ্যাট আই উইল ক্রিয়েট অ্যান্ড নিউ ব্রাঞ্চ দিস ইজ পার্ট দিস উইল বি পার্ট সিক্স অফ আদার টিউটোরিয়াল সরি চেক আউট ফ্রম হেয়ার দ্য টিউটোরিয়াল স্টার্ট অ্যান্ড আই উইল ক্রিয়েট অ্যান্ড রিড মি অ্যান্ড অ্যান্ড আই উইল ক্রিয়েট অ্যান্ড রিড মি হেয়ার ইন দ্য ব্যাক এন্ড and in here i will write uh, the steps uh, to follow or to uh, add your email verification and they, then i uh, i will uh, follow the steps and uh, and uh, and set up the email verification and i for change password or forget password okay uh, i have uh, write all information uh, all uh, steps here uh, the steps may can be increase or decrease uh, depends on my on this video so the steps are uh, uh, at first uh, you need a two step verification email you need a you have to create create app with the email you have to generate the pass and password app password and you have to set up these variables I, i will show you how to set up these variables and you uh, may need a python decouple to and set email email and password to your environment vari uh, variable and you have to set up an endpoint for verify email for verify email view and you have to uh, to uh, edit message email message you have to write to template uh, template and the this is it and we are going through uh, this the steps in this tutorial but um i uh, said that uh, i will uh, make uh, make uh, make um, reset email or forget password before uh, the email verification step but it is not possible to uh, reset a password without a, an email verification and that is why I, i am completing the email verification first after that i will make a video on how to uh, make uh, set up your forget password uh, endpoint so uh, um, be before uh, creating an email and creating app and generate password we can uh, so uh we can uh, get emails from our console when we are debugging uh we are not in our uh, develop uh, on on where we are we are on not product or not in production we are in development we can uh, uh see uh, the this uh, python manage dot py run server a uh, 0.0.0.0 and it was 2h1000 and it will uh, run and, and then after that we can um, set account email verification to mandatory to our settings dot py here uh, here account email verification is non uh, we can set it to mandatory and uh, now from now it will require email verification with this variable and uh, we need email with, uh, to get email we have to set email back back end variable and we will copy the email ba back end variable and we we'll set up uh, here the email back end this is the email back end uh it may help if i create an another branch with this 
for you with the readme.md for you you can uh, see and copy it uh, from the variable name from here and copy it at there and it takes a django.col.mail.backend.stsmtp.email backend uh, it can also take console.email backend on that case if i pass here and console.email backend on that case you will get a uh, email in this console uh, let me show you i have run i have to run the front end sorry run and it will run uh, so there here is the login uh, if you are logged in you can log out from here and we are going to register a new account and we will see our email ca will ca ca will show in this console app. before we set up the uh, email for our email here I will say nickname user 9 and email is email 9 at the rate of gmail dot com 1 g p t u z 6 a 1 g p t u z 6 a okay and if I try it if I try to register here you will see you will see and email come here when where it is saying that we should we have to confirm our email account so here uh, here uh, mm, there this is the subject this is to email to my email and hello from example.com this uh, it has recognized this site as example.com you can change the site from, from the admin panel on that case you have to go to admin panel and go to site and you have to edit this domain and you name the domain name you to your website name and it will change uh, the uh, example.com and then uh, then it has uh, you are received this email because you, uh, user user 9 has given your email to register an account and to confirm uh, it, it is uh, it uh, said uh, us to go to this URL and uh, yes but uh, but this is not okay actually uh, we need uh, the email to our g to its gmail to send the email to gmail we have to uh, set it uh, to smtp backend and smtp backend and you have to pa uh, go th through the process and set up the these variables but before that uh, before set up in this way this step and variables i want to set up uh, this step uh, actually this uh, six to eight step because i want to edit the email actually we uh, will not set the set this url to the uh, to uh, to verify the uh, to verify from app i want to verify uh, verify from web i want to verify my account from our app that is why I, uh, and and i ha i want to edit this email okay you can edit this email but from uh, uh fro from django before that you have to uh, set up your endpoint and uh, this is the uh, this is the endpoint as uh, save this endpoint uh, to uh, user under user app under urs.py you have to import from dj rest auth dot registration dot view import verify email view and you have to paste the uh, this path to the urls dot py here uh, we will take auth 
on the auth dot auth and we will pass confirm email and we will uh, use verify email view as view and we will do not change the name because it needs this name okay and mm, okay and if I uh, visit the this endpoint from if I visit this endpoint uh, local host and move to end this endpoint uh, it's oh, okay uh, you need user first and then auth user first then auth here uh, we have to pass here and key and uh, and it is a post method this endpoint is a post method so uh, what is the key from the uh, email we can see from the email we can see the uh, the key is this last thing we will copy it uh, co uh, account confirm email then slash then this last thing is the key if we try it on as a key then if i uh, click on post it will say details is okay that that is mean the email is verified mm this is the process but we are getting an uh, email for uh, for a web but we need email for our app uh, you can see this is the email for this it is given e url uh, i do not need this url we will say i need that uh, token yes we, we will say i need this only this token uh, to verify uh, it is you uh, so what we can do for th th this uh, thing we, we can add a, a template path to our uh, to our settings.py in settings.py we will import os we will import import os after importing os after under template dirs we will set a path uh, to os dot path dot join base dir and with the base dir we are we will add our uh, and folder folder template and we have to create the folder template uh, temp la tes templates we have created a folder templates and here under template template uh, uh, there is a template under account account folder there is templates under account folder uh, under account folder under email folder under email folder we have to create uh, email confirm message.txt create file email confirm message.txt and we have to create another file email underscore confirm underscore subject dot txt and we have to edit uh, this message I will send you to, uh, to uh, you can uh, get the message from my github account we need to message I will copy paste it from my previous project I have written I have uh, get uh, this uh, message uh, and I will copy another message email confirm email subject and this is the subject uh, so we have to edit this template this template is uh, made for web but we have to create this template for our app version yeah, it says uh, please confirm your uh, your uh, okay uh, email confirm your e email to sign sign in and uh, here uh, 
a hello from the site name it says hello from the site name and loads account okay user and user display We have to edit this and say we need only token not everything activate url not activate url we need uh, only the last thing okay there are an under context there are an variable name key so uh, this is the key to confirm our uh, our account I have found it from this uh, documentation it says uh, it uh, the send mail is written in under all auth account adapter and default account adapter under default account adapter and there is the method send mail and this send mail gets in context ctx and it has a variable key where is a confirmation key so uh, we have to use an under here and co confirmation key uh, name key so uh, to confirm and uh, to confirm I say okay we are receiving an email because you are receiving an email because your user display has given an email has given your email as email account uh, email address uh, to account their account and email address to account uh, to connect to their account because uh, sorry and to confirm this uh, correct go no to confirm this is correct uh, not go to a uh, we will say use this token in your app this is correct you use this token in the app and we will pass the key as the token thank you uh, site from your site yes this is it uh, so and now if i register from another user ten email ten register uh, oh but where is the message did I remove the email backend okay sorry I have uh, removed the uh, console email backend I will try again eleven eleven okay in uh, here you can see to confirm this is correct uh, use the token in in your app you can see this is that it is giving us as the token and now if we use the token in uh, our endpoint this is the endpoint and refresh it and use the key and try to post here yes uh, it says the uh, details is equal ok this is means this means uh, our email is verified uh, yes and now we have we will use our uh, we have uh, successfully edit our our e message email message confirmation message and now we will we'll try to send the email from email to, to to the gmail to that gmail to verify and in this case we will use smtp email backend and we will use the variables here Uh, okay 
here are the variables we'll copy it actually I will copy it and paste it here to send email to gmail these are the variable and we will set up our um, email and password in our environment variable to set up email password in our environment variable we will create an dot env file here dot e n dot env sorry dot env Uh, here we will pass uh, the e email host here I will uh, paste my username email username and email host password we have to uh, use python decouple uh, I'll to decouple copy it and install it in our backend and we have to import decouple for to our settings.py and now it is ok so email email backend is this uh, smtp backend smtp is gmail true mm, email po post here uh, and user is email host user and password is the password our app password and uh, we, ha we have to confirm the email and uh, this is the env here i will use my email here uh, suppose a uh, hog r2 rider uh, okay we will see now uh, i will go to our uh, my gmail what is the gmail name the gmail is name is hawk 3 rider 474 gmail.com this is my gmail hawk 3 rider 474 at the rate of gmail.com and here I, and I will create an app here ok create Uh, gmail mailing app for google account not uh, I will give you the link ok it has given me a page here uh, it says and to sign in here under security I will give you the link under security uh, I will copy it and paste to the my to my readme the security uh, there is an option app password to help. Uh, 
and log in here and here you can see I can create an app for mailing and devices other custom name tutorial auth tutorial generate it ok uh, auth tutorial it has generated ok I for I <laughs> ok I forget to copy the password uh, again I have to create it and delete mailing other name auth tutorial generate this is the password uh, yeah password for your device ok uh, paste it uh, to my backend under dot env host password this is my host password email and host password yes done and now now we can we have generated password we have set up variables and the last step is mm, we will we have to do everything here and, and and last step is we will register mail dot google dot com we register with my gmail hawk to reader hawk to rider four seven four at the rate of gmail dot com okay sorry cut it paste here mm, nickname test auth ok uh, uh, try to I'll try to restart now what is going on on back end what it said auth require support uh, exception we got an error going to check it I will delete my email and again try you can try yourself ok uh, I don't know why decouple didn't work mm, this environment didn't work mm, I saw uh, that when I copy paste the variables or uh, email here or uh, email and uh, password here it worked fine and you can see there is no error I, I again delete the user and sh show you that delete the user and again if I try to log in ok ok I have to delete another thing user and email address delete this email and the user after that see the backend and register from here ok 
here uh, on this second part post request you will can get uh, to 201 it means uh, the email is uh, successfully sent and each but it give us an error that is SMTP sender error refused I don't know why it refused uh. oh okay uh, but this is the process i will uh, try another uh, with my another e email and password uh, okay i have found the problem it said your message wasn't delivered because email so, uh, could not be found but i am using hop to rider Okay, I think I have to uh, remove uh, I wipe the app and restart again and try it again and delete the user from the backend and If I try to register now, but why there is no user? Okay. Okay, now check the email. Nothing happened. Okay, uh, it is refusing because it needs to confirm me. I click on check activities and it uh, take me to this page. It was not be before. It is new. I have to confirm my account. And again uh, try it. Uh, let the user and I will check it here no email again ok under the sent message I can see I have sent message uh, to hawk to writer but from address to address subject and it is not uh, taking or uh, not accepting um,
draft on more spam okay the email uh, stored under spam you are receiving this email because the authentic user okay why why this message is spam it is similar to messages that were identified at spam spam in past okay this is why uh, it is res uh, not taking our showing us the email okay how oh, we have to change the uh template and make a uh, anything else that will not uh, send me this message then Uh, okay it worked uh, here i have got an email this is and uh, i have edit uh, the i have removed the example.com from the email body and uh, it successfully uh, sent my email in the confirmation message i have removed all the example.com mm, it was it was uh, this site name i have removed the site name and i will also remove the site name okay this is it uh, after that uh, it has uh, i have successfully able to send my message to the to customer or to uh, to confirm their email and you have to add this endpoint to your account and i am going to add end the tutorial for, from uh, tutorial now and i will uh, show you the front end of the app mm, later assalamu alaikum